at the request of Humayun Kabir, the Union Minister of Education, Buddhadev went to Delhi and Mysore in 1952 to supervise innovative teaching methods for senior faculty. In 1953, Kobita appeared in a bilingual edition, which met with immediate success. It also featured the young Shunil Gangopadhyay's work for the first time. The same year, Buddhadev went to the United States as a Fulbright lecturer. In 1954, he edited the second edition of Adhunik Bangla Kobita, or Modern Bengali Poetry, widely accepted as the primary text on the subject. Unfortunately, the year also witnessed Jibon Anondo's death in a tram accident. A bereaved Buddhadev dedicated the next issue of Kobita to him, reviewing his work, and it remains an important source of material on Jibon Anondo. Although the educationist Shottin Bose requested Buddha Deb in 1955 to take charge of the Department of English in Bishwabharati Shantiniketan, he had already become deeply involved in the foundation of Jadavpur University under Trigunashen as an initiative of the National Council of Education. In 1956, he joined the university he had helped to build as founder and head of the Department of Comparative Literature, pioneering this discipline in Asia. He asked the poet Shudhindranath Dotto to join the faculty too. The same year, Buddhade brought out a volume of children's verse titled Baro Masher Chora, or Rhymes for Twelve Months, which many regard as his best writing for children. Also that year, after the death of the famous novelist Manik Bandupadhyay, he evaluated Bandupadhyay's literary genius in Kobita. Buddha Dev's 1958 book of poems, J. Adhar Alor Odhik, or The Darkness That Is Greater Than Light, heralded a change in style, more classical, less romantic, and consisting of shorter pieces, including many sonnets. Despite his huge output of original writing, the quantity of translations by him from classical and modern literature is phenomenal. It encompasses works as diverse as Kalidasa's Meghadutam from Sanskrit, Baudelaire's poetry from English, and Rilke's poetry from German, testifying to his eclectic but enlightened understanding of various cultural contexts. Although none of Buddhadev's works was cinematized during his lifetime, a film was made in 1988 of his short story, Ikti Jibon, or A Life, written in 1960 about one man's lifelong labor to prepare a Bengali dictionary. (music) 
1961, the birth centenary of Tagore, Buddhadev was invited to deliver lectures on Tagore in Rangoon, Hong Kong, Tokyo, Honolulu, and New York. However, this year saw the closure of Kobita. Kobita Puttika bondo hoy jabar khobor shune amra prothome bishwashi korte parini. Ei puttika chilo amader kabbo jagote probesher chharpotto dito. Ei puttika sthan pele amra dhonno hoy jetam amra mone korttam je buddhodev boshur moton ekjon birat kobi tar kach theke shikriti pacchi. আমরা বুকে ভয় নিয়ে স্টলে গিয়ে কবিতা পত্রিকার পাতা উল্টাতে সাহস করতাম না যে ভেতরে আমাদের কবিতা আছে কি নেই কবিতা থাকলে অপূর্ব আনন্দে মন ভরে যেত তখন এই পত্রিকা বন্ধ হবার খবর শুনে মনে হলো যে আমাদের পরবর্তীকালের কবিদের কি হবে পরবর্তী তরুণরা কোথায় পাবে এই স্বীকৃতি অবশ্য বুদ্ধদেব বসুর উপরে এই জন্যে আমরা রাগ করিনি কারণ তবু তো তিনি দীর্ঘ ছাব্বিশ বছর কত রকম পরিশ্রম করে আত্মত্যাগ করে সময় দিয়ে এই পত্রিকা প্রকাশ করেছেন একটা কবিতার পত্রিকা এই দীর্ঘকাল ধরে প্রকাশ করতে যে কত রকম ঝঞ্ঝাট পোহাতে হয় তা আমি এখন জানি বুদ্ধদেব বসু এই পত্রিকা আমাদের ইতিহাসে বিরাট স্থান করে নিয়েছে The poet Shubhash Mukhopadhyay said, Kobita was the delivery room of modern poets and Buddhadev its midwife. In 1962, the University of Bombay published Buddhadev's talks in English on Tagore under the title Tagore, Portrait of a Poet. Buddhadev left Jadavpur University to teach for a semester at Indiana University in the United States in 1963. Afterwards, he taught in New York, Colorado, Illinois, Hawaii, and Japan. Upon his return, he published a travel log including an appreciation of the painter Rembrandt. Arthik Durguti Chudanto তবু তিনি সৃষ্টিশীলতায় অবিচল মৃত্যুর পর তার সম্পত্তি রইল কিছু জীর্ণ পোশাক ছবি আঁকার সরঞ্জাম আর রইল অমরত্ব ইন নাইনটিন সিক্সটি সিক্স হি ডেলিভার্ড দ্য শরৎচন্দ্র মেমোরিয়াল লেকচার অন টু গোর অ্যাট দ্য ইউনিভার্সিটি অফ ক্যালকাটা and released a play after 22 years Toposhi o Torongini or the Sage and Torongini which won the Sahitya Academy award In stylized prose it showed the mythical Rishyasringa's seduction by an enchantress as the awakening of love and suffering and spirituality through sex Buddha Dev had thought deeply about this play as performance not just a text for reading kono ek bishesh karone ek kishor tapashir sharire chalate hobe modon chala kamatur obosthay take niye aste hobe rajdhanite ei champanagore tumi o tomar shongira hobe char sarno mekhla parbe This success initiated a late surge of drama. From 1968 to 1970, Buddha Dev published six plays, four of them poetic dramas based on episodes from the epic Mahabharata, and the other two absurdist in nature. As a contributor to new horizons in Bengali verse drama, Buddha Dev proved a worthy successor to Tagore. In 1969, novel Rath Bhore Brishti or Rain Through the Night was sued for obscenity. 
but the court verdict in 1973 cleared him of the charges. In 1970, the government of India bestowed the Padma Vibhushan on Buddha Dev, but he did not go to the award ceremony, nor did he accept the award. During the early 1970s, he wrote a memoir of his boyhood, also the analytical Mahabharata Katha, or On the Mahabharata. composed over many years and his last book of poetry shagoto bidai or prophetically welcome farewell less emotional and more in the nature of perception on a march evening in 1974 he breathed his last leaving behind a revised manuscript of Tithidor lying on his enchanted desk Buddha Dev Bos is honored today by practicing writers and uninitiated readers alike as one of the giants of bengali literature